Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Just wanted to come on and share with you some of my Alveda shampoos and conditioners that I have purchased over the years and I really enjoy using them and just wanted to share that with you just in case you're interested in um, some of the products and just to give you an idea of how they work on my hair and how I like them and how I use them. Um, so yeah, that was it. Just wanted to share that. This is not sponsored. This is not sponsored, just sharing. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with the first one and it is the Aveda Rosemary Mint one here. I have been through multiple bottles of this one right here. This is my reset, my reset shampoo here. It's supposed to um, remove all buildup, any kind of um, silicones and um, everything that you have in your hair pretty much. It's a reset. If you use it one time you can tell the difference in the cleanse. If you use it two times, you're going to get that squeaky, that squeaky cleanse. It is going to strip your hair um, of whatever products and stuff that you um, have in your hair, the oils and things. I do have notes here, a little bit here. So it says it's a gentle clarifying shampoo that leaves your hair feeling, um, feeling squeaky shiny and cleanse yes my hair do feel nice and cleanse it does feel squeaky just a regular kind of shampoo the smell i love the smell of it it's the rosemary and it's peppermint that's in this one here smells good and well you can see that it's a clear it's a clear shampoo so that's what this one here is for i usually use this one like maybe once a month or every like every two months or so it depends on how my hair is feeling what my hair needs you know when i had my protein overload yes i'm getting ready to bring that up again i'm because i'm blessed that it went away or it was corrected put it that way when i did um you had that protein overload this was like one of the ones i kept cleansing my hair with because you do need to go in and remove all that buildup and stuff from your hair and I felt that this one did the job because I actually was using it every week you don't supposed to use it every week I guess like that but I guess I needed to to help remove that buildup and stuff that I had on my hair but then I would wash one time with this but follow up the second wash with like a moisturizing shampoo so that's what I would do with this cleanser right here. Love the way my hair feel after using this to reset my curls. So good shampoo, good shampoo. Now, I do have another, I think this is like a, this is also like a gentle um, cleanser but it's not like a gentle harsh it's not like a harsh clarifying um shampoo and it's this one the brilliant this was my very first purchase from alveda um of course you know you watch i was watching mo knows and this was like one of the ones on her list and i was like let me try that one and i fell in love with this one i have been using this one for years i feel that it cleanses the um, silicones and everything from my hair, the buildup that I have. It does not strip my hair. I can go in two times with this, and I feel that my hair is not stripped or anything. It still feel like it, it still feels, and it, my hair doesn't feel coated. So it still feel like it still have like that softness and, and it has the shine and everything to it, but I can, cleanse two times if I want to with this but most of the times I will cleanse a good cleanse from that shampoo through my strands really good and then after rinsing then I'll go in with my second cleanse with a moisturizing um, shampoo but this one right here it lathers up it cleanses my hair 
Um, I can like run or pull my hair apart. I love to pull my hair apart when I'm cleansing if I can't run my fingers through. And this one right here has like that, I guess like an Alveda smell. I don't know. It's kind of earthy kind of smell, I guess. That's what that one smells like. So yes, love to use this one. And this one right here, the same thing. It says that you, you can use this daily. I wouldn't use it daily. I wouldn't. Um, it's supposed to remove buildup and leave your hair um, soft, shiny, and um, everything. I'm not sure if this is color safe, but it is for all hair types. Um, it is silicone free. All of these that I do have here, they are silicone free, parabens free, all of that there. And um, they all supposed to be a gentle cleanse. So if I go to repeat myself, all of them is a, gen a gentle cleanse, all of the ones. But I do like to use this one. I can see myself using this one here like maybe um, twice out of the month. I will use this one um, because it gets my hair cleansed. It cleanses my hair, especially if I want to use like um, one brand and then go into the next week like a, a different brand or the week after a different brand it kind of kind of like cleanse my hair there I have to worry about the, the build up on my strands or or worry about having them flake the flakes and stuff I guess after applying my products or so I don't know but it cleanses my hair really nicely without stripping and it leaves it nice and soft and shiny that's the main thing that I really like the like about this um, shampoo so let's go ahead and get into my next one now this um, shampoo right here I have been using since last summer, yeah, last summer I purchased this line. I think I got everything, almost everything in this one here. And it's this one here. And I also have the um, conditioner. Now this right here, I like this one here. This one is the deep moisturizing one. It does come with, I think it's light moisture, but I got the one for deep moisture. It does moisturize my hair. It leaves it nice and shiny. I'm able to pull my hair apart. It lathers nicely without, it does not strip my hair or anything. This um, shampoo right here, it does have oat in here and it has coconut oil extracts and other extracts so it had just a pinch of like strengthening but no other like proteins or anything that I've seen in here but more of the like the oils and butters kind of like on that strengthening side but this leaves your hair more on the moisture side it's like I feel more of the moisture in the shampoo so that's why I like to use this one here I like to use this one actually as I want to say like if I want to cleanse my hair in the middle of the week or if I want to use this like every other weekend or every like every other week when I go to wash my hair that's how I like to use this one here because I feel that it's very gentle, very moisturizing, does not strip, but it cleans my hair nicely and it gives my hair that extra like little boost of moisture. So that's why I like to use that one. This is a creamy one, just more of the creamy textured. So that's very nice. And um, the smell, it smells like an Alveda to me. <laughs> It smells good. It smells good. But yeah, love the way this feel. And the conditioner, love the conditioners. I have um this here is like the I think this is supposed to be like the regular conditioner because this is you can use this for a regular conditioner or a deep conditioner because this was the only conditioner that they had for this line. They did end up coming out with a deep conditioner. And I like both of them. The other, the deep conditioner, it's more on the expensive side. This one is a little bit more just reasonable. 
um, still in the $20 mark there. But I like this one better. Why? Because I feel that this one has more slip. It's super more, it's nice and moisturizing on my hair. Um, so I just let it sit there and then rinse it out. It's just really moisturizing. I do like this conditioner here. Of course, this one does have oat in it too as well and those butters and oil extracts. But both of these right here are great, nice. It moisturizes your hair. Um, I like these. I like this um, combo right here. Now, I will use and I will use them with some of my other like um, shampoos and conditioners. So if I use this this right here conditioner, I have paired it with my TGIN shampoo and then this one right here, nice and moisturizing wash day, nice and moisturizing. And this right here, if I wanna just use this and maybe use maybe like my, my Miche or another deep conditioner, it works nicely. So they work. They work good with other products too as well. Um, it's supposed to be, a, did I say color treated? Um, it's supposed to um, be color treated safe. So that's what it said on the website. Let's go ahead and get into my next one here. Now, this one right here, I started using this one, I wanna say the end of December, like the end of December. And it is the the color corrector this one right here love the shampoo it's moisturizing it leaves my hair nice and shiny nice and healthy it feels good when I go to wash it la oh it lathers up a whole lot it does not strip my hair it does not fade my color and that's what it says it do not supposed to fade your color or um, or your highlights and it's supposed to be good for if you have chemical treated hair or so so this is one here so if you have um, color treated hair I'm trying to get into shampoos that won't strip or fade my color so fast because I sometimes I'll just use any kind of shampoo and it's like you know what my color is just fading I have to keep coloring my hair keep coloring my hair so I'm trying to be good with that um, this year so I do like this one here and I feel that um, it has been working um, it doesn't fade my color as fast so anyway I'm still I mean I just like the way it feel in my hair just nice soft moisturizing um, I do cleanse like one time with this a good cleanse run it through my strands and pull my hair apart um, and then I will go in with like a moisturizing shampoo. Um, the reason I say that, it feels like it has a little pinch of strengthening, but it's more on the moisture side, more on the moisture side. So that's the way I feel with this. And I don't have like that, that hair shedding. You know how you, you wash your hair and then at the end of your wash, you have like hair in the tub. I don't have like a whole ball of hair. So that's why I actually like these here. That's why I like them. I don't have that big ball of hair coming out at the end of my wash day. So yeah, but love this one here. Very gentle, silicone free and the conditioner, very moisturizing. Love this one right here. I use this one actually as like a 10 minute deep condition. I just put it on and it glides on. It's easy to run my fingers through with this one. Very moisturizing and silicone free too as well. And it's supposed to also help with the color. And it is the texture Come on. This one. Oh, this one is not. <laughs> this is a new one. I have these. This is the new one. I have a little one in the bathroom. The little small one like this. <laughs> I have the little small one like this. So I was trying to use up that one before I opened this one. So yeah, my sister actually gave me this set here for Christmas. The larger set. But I'm still working on my second 
bottle of the new of, of this one, the second bottle of the smaller one. So, and I didn't want to open the the big bottle because what I do when it comes to Alveda products, I like to purchase the small bottles first before I go in with the larger bottle. I usually purchase it maybe like two times and then it's like that second after I finish those two whatever small bottles and then it's like okay so did I like it? Did it work? Is that something I'm interested in? I'm going to use all the time. Then I was like you know what I do. So then I'll go back when they have that great big sale then that's when I go and I'll purchase the large bottle. So that's what I do. Um, with their products there, you can return their products if you don't like it, if you feel that it's not working for you. But just the um, FYI, as far as I know, you, you can't get a return or a refund. You can exchange it for something else. I don't know if they changed the policy or anything, but most of the times I get something and I like it, so I haven't did like a return or anything. But um, other than that, that's how I purchase my Alveda products. So let's go ahead and get into my next um, favorite that I have been using. Now this line right here, I purchased the same time that I purchased the color, um, the, this line here. I purchased this right here, the same time, and I like this one. Yes, I like it. I like Alveda uh, shampoos and conditioners. This, this line right here is supposed to be for if you blow dry your hair out, if you straighten your hair, and it's supposed to help with anti-frizz. So that's what this line is for. But the lady, she told me that it's still good for curly hair too as well. So that's why I um, purchased this one along with the, um, the color um, corrector. And this one is nothing but moisture. Moisture. My hair is so soft, so moisturized, and easy to run my fingers through, and it just lathers up. This one right here, it doesn't lather up a whole lot like a gentle, soft lather. But my hair feels feel cleansed. Now that's what I used on this this right here. This is my wash and go using that uh, innocent gel. So this is seven. This is day seven. She is a little <laughs> a little dry or so, but this right here, I love this one right here. Very moisturizing, and it said it's supposed to help with frizz. I don't know. I don't know. But I feel that um, it did help just a little bit, but it did give me that moisture. I'm looking at my notes here. I feel that this one right here, it, it did give me the moisture. It definitely gave me the moisture. It says here that it's a gentle cleanse, moisturizing, enhanced shine um, while fighting frizz, protect against um, humidity. It did say it's supposed to protect against humidity, keeping the hair smooth and sleek, and it's colored safe too as well. So that's what it says here. Check out the website on all of these products. When you do go to um, purchase them, see what ingredients is um, on them, see which ones that you think you may like the best. And yeah, this conditioner, this one is super moisturizing too. I don't even know if it's anything. It's a little bit left in here. I know this one is almost gone. But yes, this conditioner, I left it on for a few minutes. Just that splash of water ran my fingers through. I felt that my hair was so soft, so moisturizing too as well. Um, very light. It's a very light, but it's, you know, it's white. Very light conditioner not heavy this is yeah the products these here are not like heavy products here these are light now I would use this I can't wait now summertime between these here when I like to co-wash a little bit more and I would you rotate between these two here this one right here I would use 
just every week in the middle if I just want a quick oh just want a quick refresh my hair just stick go in the shower do a little and <laughs> hydrate it this is what I would go in with because it leaves my hair that moisturizing in my hair it felt nice and cleansed but more on the moisturizing side there but yes guys if you're interested start off with the small ones first and remember you can exchange it and see if you like it read the ingredients though first all the ones that I have here pretty much are I didn't see any harsh proteins or anything in there but you have to remember the oils and um, or so they kind of play a part of like strengthening and I feel that um, most of them that I have here are moisturizing are very moisturizing um, so yeah but anyway these are what the ones that I like and hopefully maybe you guys can try it and let me know how you like it if so let me know down in the comment area and I will see you in my next one Alrighty, guys all right, guys, I'm just popping back in because I left one of my Alveda um, shampoo and conditioners out. And it is the Champier, Champier, this right here. Very moisturizing, very, leave your hair very soft, cleanse the hair nicely. It's supposed to be a gentle cleanse. I use it usually like like sometimes I will use it two times it depend on um, what I have in my hair if I have silicones in my hair or if I do like a hot oil treatment every so often like every other month I will do like a hot oil treatment or so and I will go in with this shampoo and it cleanse it right out why because it does have sulfates sulfates it's supposed to be a gentle cleanse but I use it sometimes I use it two times sometimes I may use it like wash one time good time with this and then use one of my other shampoos um, and I feel that it works fine there I feel that this shampoo it does have nice slip and it's easy to pull my hair apart it just makes my hair just so soft so soft and the conditioner the same thing it makes my hair just so soft nice slip and um, I like these I like these two right here it's more of a nearish kind of um, shampoo and conditioner if you want that soft your hair to be nice and soft I feel that it does um, do that and it lathers up nicely too as well it is a, a clear a clear type shampoo it has that elevator smell but it's more on the maybe it can come out see it like a clear shampoo and you guys see me use this plenty of <laughs> quite a few times quite a few times and but yeah this is a good one if you're looking for a sulfate shampoo very nice very lathery um, I'm not sure if I will repurchase these here because I do have some of my other Alveda um, shampoos and conditioners that I do like and they pretty much do the same as this leave my hair nice and soft nice and moisturizing and clean now if I was doing like a, um, if I had like silicones um, in my hair or doing my hot oil treatment or so I will go in with either probably it's like like this one or maybe this one right here but these two right here do also remove silicones and if you do like a hot oil treatment on your hair these here will cleanse your hair really good too as well but yes but anyway just didn't want to leave that um alveda um collection out because it's a very good one too as well Anyway, guys, I'll talk to you later.